What is up everybody? Good morning from the great area of Canada. True north, far north, north, the North Pole. I don't know. Anyway, me and Allie are in Toronto. We are helping out our friends, Eamon and Beck, with the one of a kind show, which is like a huge Christmas expo. It's for small businesses that make handcrafted items which their chai is handcrafted. We've been at the booth for five days now, six days. Yeah. I think this is our sixth day. It's really fun. Their chai is delicious. We've been having a blast. We have two days left. We're on the final stretch. We thought it would be cool to take you guys into the building, show you what Chai Walla's booth looks like, show you what a day in the life of a chai salesman is like. So we're actually staying in our van in a parking lot across the street from the expo center and we get to open today. So me and Allie are gonna head over to the booth and get things started. So it's actually been really cool to park here. Parking tickets are only $10, which is like $7 American, and it's for 24 hours. That's cheaper than most campgrounds. We got everything we need right inside that little van. Came here a week ago just for this show because our friends Eamon and Beck needed some help. And we said, yeah, We'll drive across international borders, come help you sell some chai, because we're good friends. And it's actually been a lot of fun. I used to do sales a lot. Even this type of sales is just like kind of fun to dabble in every once in a while, so I've been having a blast. And here's our booth. Good morning, chai. Good morning, fish. Good morning, fish. <laughs> All right. So we have a really nice morning routine. We set up a couple canisters for demonstrations and samples. We have a latte version and a regular tea version. We restock all the shelves, we open up the tea, we set up our Polaroid camera. So we got about 10 minutes. Oh shoot, five minutes. Five minutes to get the show on the road. Allie ran to get some coffee because we're gonna have a little bit of coffee and I'm gonna get a donut so I got some carbs for the morning. Then we're gonna get this show underway. We uh, are almost out of their original blend, which is these three shelves. As you can see, they are pretty scarce. We're gonna try and sell the rest of that this morning before anybody shows up with more. Oh, and here comes Allie with the coffee. Okay, now we're ready to rock and roll. I brought sustenance. Cheers. Get him, Allie. Rain in those customers. Yeah, that's right. No, I'm, I'm better than that. <laughs> so this is the fishery or the canned fish booth. They have a ton of rubber bands and they've been shooting rubber bands at us nonstop, just like this. <gasps> it's been a battle to say the least. Hey, would you like to try a chai latte? Mm. All natural. You wanna grab our lunch? Yeah. What do we take? Two of those, I think. Unless it says like no carrots or anything on it. So that's the chai tea. Probably the same. It says the goods. All right, let's go eat lunch. Okay, bye bye. Take your, umbre your, your umbrella. umbrella. Take your umbrella off. I'm gonna miss not having you. This my one umbrella? Sample, yeah, take no, your No, someone will put it on. I like my umbrella. Okay. <laughs> All I gotta do is follow Allie's curly hair. It's pretty hard to lose. It's crowded here too. Sorry, right, it'll be easier to find a spot though. About to chow down, we'll pick you guys up after lunch. It's fun, this is kind of like the life of a small business owner. We're getting to meet a lot of really cool other vendors. It's given us the itch for sure. Makes you want to make something and sell it. It really does. And you see all the love and the passion that people put into their products. Like, yeah. we believe in the chai. We believe in pretty much everything here. 
once you hear their stories and like what it takes to make everything, this is all handmade, unique, one of a kind items. It's pretty incredible. Yeah, it's really fun. And it makes you, like I said, makes you want to start making a crap and going out and selling it. I have like a history in sales. So sales just like kind of comes naturally to me. And it's it's fun to kind of get my finger in Chaiwala and help out. And we're, yeah. we're just having a blast. And we get to hang out with our friends. So yeah. it's like the best of both worlds. That's you know? the most fun part. Yeah. But I think our lunch break is over. So we're going to kind of stroll back through some of the shops and head over to Chaiwala. Let's do it. of us having three different couples here, the Matneys, ourselves, and Eamon and Beck, is that we can all work in shifts. So we don't get super burnt out. We can each give each other a little break so that we have a little bit of downtime during the day. And then we all come back pepped up with a lot of energy. It's good. It's a lot of fun and everybody's like working with each other. We're like a big team. Yeah. We're just, we're having a great time. Floor 17, going up. So obviously, as you guys know, me and Ali, Eamon and Beck, and Christian and Aubrey all live in vans, but with parking being such a pain in the butt in downtown Toronto, we don't want to have to worry about where the vans are, if they're running out of power because they're not moving, paying for parking every day. So Eamon and Beck got this sweet Airbnb for everybody to stay in, even though me and Ali are actually still staying in the van because we don't want to crash on the couch. So this Airbnb is in a perfect location. It's right across the street from the expo center so we can literally like wake up step across the street we're at work ready to go and it's great for when you punch out and you come over here and take a break you have a couch that you can lay on you can maybe even turn on the tv if you want it's got a real bathroom it's great so the responsibility of picking up dinner for the entire squad has been dropped onto us or actually we offered to do it and everybody wanted us to pick up dinner. So we're here at Bobby Sue's Mac and Cheese, which is like a tiny little hole in the wall mac and cheese joint here in Toronto. We're getting six vegan mac and cheese entrees and we're gonna take them back to the show so everybody can eat. The guy goes a whole bunch for Allie. Yep, a whole bunch. That's for me. Six gallons of mac and fake cheese. <laughs> Nothing beats it. All right, pouring rain. We got to get back to the show. Back we'll to the C and E. Our friends. I don't know if we can eat this on the way. Onward. All right, Booth. We'll see you in the morning. Good night, beautiful Booth. Thank you for your love. I don't know. We had a really busy day and forgot to film all of it after dinner. That's pretty classic. It is classic. Pretty classic. We were grinding. It was a busy Saturday night. It was such a great day. <laughs> so now we're all gonna go load up in the car, head back to the Airbnb and decompress. Then we're gonna go to bed. Oat milk. And we've got some oat milk. Pretty cool, that's the CN Tower in Toronto. You can't really see the top of it because of the clouds and it's like all red. Kinda looks like a UFO. All right, let's go back to the Airbnb. <laughs> Just... Whoa, my gosh. <laughs> wow. You're teaching him bad things, Trent. <gasps> I didn't teach him bad Yes, you did. <laughs> yeah, Trent taught me that. That's not true. Whoa. What are the matinees up to? Yo. Just getting massaged up, dude. Killed it! Was we had a great, amazing day. You want to sign off with us really fast? Yeah. Yeah, let's sign off the vlog. Can you do a quick sign off? Yeah. So it was awesome working the show today with everybody. As you guys see, the Matneys, Eamon and Beck, myself and Allie all had a great time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We want to thank you guys all so much for watching. Tell the people what to do. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, like it if you did so, and we'll see you in the next video. See you guys on the next one. <laughs> Bye. Bye. All right guys, that was kind of the fake sign off. We wanted to bring you guys back to the van, sit down for a minute, tell you how much fun we've been having here in Toronto, how much we love Canada, and it's just, I mean, it's wonderful. It's rained, it hasn't even been cold enough to snow, so. 
We love you guys. Please smash the like button if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're not already. And we'll talk to you soon. See you guys in the next one.